Hi, welcome to Northern Thrifters. My name is Melinda and today I'll be unboxing my winter Lux box for December 2019. And this is what the box looks like. If you're not aware of Lux box, it is a seasonal Canadian subscription box. They charge $26 Canadian per quarter with free shipping. You just have to add the taxes that are applicable to your province. And we're supposed to receive seven beauty related items each quarter. So this could be things like makeup, hair care, skin care, that kind of thing. And they also offer what they call a $10 beauty surprise add-on. I never opt for that $10 add-on, but I'm kind of kicking myself this time because I noticed that people were receiving full-size Marc Jacobs Daisy Love Perfume and that's valued at around $100 Canadian but the thing is I absolutely love Marc Jacobs Daisy and Daisy Love Perfumes so um, I'm a bit jealous of the people that opted in for the $10 beauty surprise but you know what can you do <laughs> so let's just get into the regular Lux box and I can show you what's in it for this month for me anyway I'm not sure if there's too much variation and my box it's kind of like overstuffed if you can see like the lid was up a little bit so hopefully everything is all right on the inside so the first thing on the top is the Verb Ghost Oil, and it is a 60 ml of this, and I'm excited to try this. I've been looking at this at Sephora, and our local Marshalls has a whole bunch of Verb products, and I've been looking at them there as well, so I get to try it in here. And I'm kind of curious if it has a smell. I wonder if I can just take the top off. Okay, maybe a faint smell, but it's not super strong. So that's good. So that's the first product there. Very excited to get that one. The next one is kind of a repeat for me. I have it in another uh, variation from Top Box. So this is Sephora's Banana Cream Mask and it's a 50 ml size. I received the Hemp Mousse Mask in my last Top Box. And these are valued around $10 Canadian, so not a bad value. And I am glad it's not the same one <laughs> that I just got in my Top Box. So I can try another one of this. So let's just open it. I'm curious what it smells like. Okay, it's got a um, safety seal on it. Let's just give it, I'm just gonna put some on my hand here. Let's see, so it's a cream. Ooh, that smells just like bananas. Oh my gosh. Okay, I actually don't mind that. I was a bit worried seeing that it's banana that um, it'd be sort of that medicine <laughs> kind of banana smell, but it's not, it just smells like bananas. So that's pretty good. Okay, that smells really good. So the next item I'm very excited about, I love this product line. It's the Clinique Moisture Surge, and this is the 72 hour auto replenishing hydrator, and it's a 30 mil. And this size is around $27 Canadian, so pretty much the cost of the box. You get this and then everything else is free. That's I like to think about it that way. And the packaging on Clinique, I absolutely love. And this one I'm not going to open because I already have a full size of this, actually, and a mini. <laughs> so I'm going to leave this shut till I use those ones up. I do love this product. The mini, I have it in my purse because um, it's really small and I bring it to work because if I get like a little bit of a dry spot or whatever, I can put it on. I just love this. It doesn't make me break out. It's a great product. I love Clinique packaging. It's just so luxurious and high end looking. So the next item is the Skin Fix Barrier Plus Foaming Oil Cleanser and it's 177 ml. That's what it looks like here. Let's open it up and see what the bottle looks like. I'm assuming this is a full size. It's pretty big. So that's what the bottle looks like there. And this one I'm not going to test out because I will be giving this to someone else because I know they will really enjoy receiving this. So we'll keep this one shut. But that's a really good product to receive as well. I'm happy about that. The next item is a little lip balm. <laughs> not super exciting. This is the Nova Scotia Fisherman Extreme Lip Care in Canadian Maple. That's what it looks like there. Let's give this a smell. Okay, it's not, not the most appealing uh, color, but let's smell it. Okay, it smells just like maple. Okay, maple's not my like favorite scent to have in products, but I'll give it a try. 
You never know, it might be like my new favorite lip balm. <laughs> so that's the next one. The next product is a repeat for me. This is the Pure Lease Watermelon Energizing Two Minute Polishing Peel, and it's just a sample size of it. So I'm not super excited to receive this. I've already received this quite a bit in subscription boxes. I will say um, I do enjoy Pure Lease products. I love the scent and the consistency of them. Um, I have one of their moisturizers that I use as a hand cream and it's quite nice actually. It absorbs really well, but just not really excited. <laughs> so now the last item, I think this is supposed to be like our high-end item in here because this is a fairly expensive product. This is the Peter Thomas Roth Lashes to Die For Turbo Conditioning Lash Enhancer. That's what it looks like there. I'm not overly excited about this. Um, I'm not, I haven't ever been interested in trying this product out, so I'm not gonna open it because I might be giving this one away. So this is what it looks like here. I mean, it's gorgeous packaging. I'm getting fingerprints all over it. <laughs> so let's put it back in. So we'll do a quick recap. So we got the, um, I mean, this is quite a, a high-end expensive product to get. So, I mean, the value in this box is here. So we got the Peter Thomas Roth Lash Enhancer. We got the Skin Fix Cleanser. The Fisherman, what did they call this? Nova Scotia Fisherman Lip Balm. The Pure Lease Peel. The Sephora Mask the Verb Ghost Oil, which I'm excited about, and the Clinique Moisture Surge. So I think overall for $26 plus tax Canadian, it's a pretty good value this month. Not super exciting products, like I'm probably the happiest with um, these three right here. So I did get my value out of this box for sure. So let me know um, down in the comments, what did you think of this month's Lux box? And do you get Lux box? So what's your opinion of what you received? And did you get the Marc Jacobs perfume? What did you think about that? Like that's <laughs> for me would have been like so exciting to have received that. Um, or do you get another subscription box that you really like? Let me know all about it in the comments. And while you're down there, be sure to leave a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel. I'll see you next time.